by Jonathan Davis. He wants to make a mark this year. World Cup year. He wants to sniff with Wales again. The Ospreys led out by captain Justin Tiprick returns after 15 months out with injury. Everyone excited, everyone enthusiastic. Let's hope the game lives up to it. Sam Costello gets us underway at Parker Scarlets. The Ospreys, the visitors against the home team, the Scarlets. Performed exceptionally well for Wales 20s out in Italy in the Summer Series, the Six Nations Summer Series. Walking. Anscombe to the speeds to Giles back inside. This is a DIY. The opening score of the West Wales derby to that man, Gareth Anscombe and the Ospreys. Ball back in inside, but this is the one that does the damage. Owen Watkin keeps straight, puts the ball behind. And what a turn of pace from Keelan Giles. Said he's covered by Rogers, just gets him, but puts McNichol in two minds. A nice support line from Gareth Anscombe. In a funny manner, sometimes McNichol needs support. He's isolated. Holding on. Great defensive chase from the Ospreys there. Anscombe taking his time. Turns, picks the tee up swiftly. Usually a good sign. Big time player for the Scarlets. Is there a gap out wide? That's their new signing. Fifita flicks that one up. Costello, has he seen a little gap? Might have been one, but it was shut quite quickly. Calamaphoni again. Can the Scarlets generate some quick ball? But he's certainly got all the attributes to be in a quality turn. It does help if he kicks his goals, and he's done it that time. Missed the first penalty. Switch and play, be it north. Carries it one handed, offloads to Tiprick, offloads to Beard. Scarlet's fan complains. That ball was in the air. I think that's the decision that uh, Gareth Davis said, and that's why he went for it. Great strike again. And there is a change, I think, happening. Strong defensive line from the Ospreys. Tipbrick battles for the ball. Is he going to win the ball? Yeah. Stole the ball north. Gains an extra couple of yards for the Ospreys. Adam. Yeah. Let's okay, have a listen okay. to this chap. Yeah, okay. okay. Both captains and it is a lifting Stone. tackle. The player is low to the floor, but you still lifted him up above horizontal. He's landed dangerously. A low degree dangerous with the yellow card offence. Fafita tries a little shift on to Calamaphoni. All backwards for me. All backwards, says the referee. Tiprick. I said he can do everything. That's not the greatest Seven kick, gone. though. McNichol looks up. <laughs> Webb collects that one. Play on, says the referee, because the TMO will look at any issues. Struck that well, has a Sam Costello. Set. The Ospreys have a scrum. <laughs> Now have a penalty. Number 17 just pulled him straight in. Wynn Jones penalised. Just come off the bench at half time as Wynn Jones. Just him down. Perfect again. Held the man, Tipbrick through the gap. McLeod on the ball. Was there a clear release? Has he won it? The Ospreys still have the ball. Losi has won that. Johnny Williams with the offload. That has gone back from Keelan Giles. No problem there. Number 11. But they look at it again, Tom. You know, I know you're sort of uh, empty out, but if there's no cover there, is it potentially you could look at a penalty try? Nah, it's too far out for a penalty try. There will be cover coming across. Decibel level of Parker Scarlett has gone up. Johnny Williams on the outside. Breaks one. Johnny Williams. He's going to go over for the Scarlets. They've started well in this second half. And this conversion could draw them level with the Ospreys. We have a game. It's a ball out the back. He's got options left and right. A tiny bit of footwork he puts on. That's enough 
to get him on the outside. Oh, good and then he just goes through. Watch this, a little in and out. Nicky Williams, that's what you want. You want bats on props, one on one. Good pace as well. I think it was... Whatever happens here, we'll be seeing that incident again. Blade Thompson on a charge up the middle. Hardy gets it. Costello looks for a gap. Through he goes. He's going to cross. But I don't think this is going to stand. Here comes the TMO. If that's not going to appear, he'll have to blow. That's the ball, isn't it? Dewey Lake goes open. Hands up, hands up. Reese Davis waits for support. He's has in. he got the ball down? Ah, yes, he has. Adam Jones makes the call himself. Reese Davis gets the ball on the line. Well, that's Will Griffiths. I thought it was Reese Davis. Let's have a look at this again. A minute and a half to go. We're giving Sam Costello man of the match. We're saying he might have done enough. He still might have. They've got the kick to come. Anything clear. Sean I had the ball clearly on the line and nothing before. Let's it. watch this again. It looked like a try initially. I'm seeing nothing it's given us a try. A bit. Yeah, okay, thank you. Ah, oh, it's not Reese Davis. Well it is, it is. There he gets up, picks the ball. from the new man Jack Walsh for the Ospreys what a second half at Parker Scarlets a comeback from 13 points to 6 down the Scarlets led but we finished up all square